Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome back. If you're new to the channel, welcome to the channel. My name is Helen and I absolutely love everything and all things that smell good and make you feel good. So today is a vlog. We're vlogging. Now this is not my normal vlog channel. I normally vlog on the other channel, but <laughs> I figured since I'm going to hang out today, doing a little me time, a little shopping for myself, that I would just take you all with me on the shopping trips that's relevant to this channel. So I do plan on going by the the shop to pick up some more of these like earrings, the wholesale place, if they still have them. I love these little hoops or whatever. And then I plan on going to, um, I think it's three Middle Eastern stores. I want. One I've never been to, but one I go to all the time. And then the other one, they expensive. But I just figured I'd just drop in and see what they have in regards to fragrances because I got three messages and I think two of them had the same thing like on some gold and something else. Then I got some other um, gourmand fragrance suggestions that I want to sniff and see. All right, so the goal is try not to buy more than two fragrances. I just ordered one yesterday online and I ordered a few more like the day before. So the goal is to just go look and see, sniff and see, grab no more than two, possibly three, and come on out. Anything else? That's it. And then all the other stuff I'm doing today, like shopping for all my raw foods for the raw food challenge again. I did 30 days. Well, this I was supposed to do. I said I was doing 30 days, and I ended up doing 34 days. And then I finally ate something like warm last couple of days, and I'm just ready to go back to raw food. So I'll be shopping for that too. So I'll be on the other channel. So if you're interested in my um, high raw lifestyle, then come on over to the main channel. I'll put that down below. That should go up probably the same day this video is going up. I've been trying to rotate the video so they don't go up on the same day, but for some apparent reason, they be going up on the same day. So just come on, come hang out with me. Ooh. Hello, how you doing? Good morning. A friend of mine told me you have a bunch of oils. I wanted to look at the oils. How much are the oils? Ooh, it's a lot. Good morning. Good morning. Only one oil, six dollars. Only one oil, six dollars. And more yeah, than one? One for twenty. Four for twenty. Okay, I got you. I'm gonna I'm look at this is for the ladies. This uh. is for the men. For men, I have the six dollar each. Bone number nine, three. Okay, all the good so ones. Four. Okay, <laughs> look, all the good ones. <laughs> This look like the, um, yeah, I, I love a good Middle Eastern fragrance, so yes, indeed. Okay, let's see. Oh, that's not bad. It's sweet. Really? Almost smell like Marfa. Oh, this smells really good. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, oh, I kind of like this one. Hmm. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> So this one doesn't have a large selection of Middle Eastern fragrances, but let me tell you, listen, you, I can't just start off by it. I gotta sniff everything. I have to sniff everything. Oh my, I didn't even know they had dupes of like Marfa or Memo fragrances. First of all, the packaging in the bottle is beautiful. Whatever this was, I just smell is so good. But I have to stop at all these other shops first before I decide where I'm gonna purchase from. I didn't wanna just purchase because it was the first thing I saw. Like, I'm like, nah, that, that's just not me. But um, there are some other stores, and I'm going to run in and out real quick to see them. If I find that particular fragrance, I got to stop at the earrings. Uh, if I find that particular fragrance um, under 59, <laughs> she get that. Oh, my goodness. I'm about to go online and compare the price. So, watch out on find online. I've never seen that online. I've never seen that online. So, um, yeah. So, now I'm just looking around to see what other stores I want to stop at. There are some within the, like, the mall area i need some bakor i haven't had that in so long we used to smoke it it's not smoke it like smoke but let it smoke in the house back in the day baby if this thing dropped one more time <laughs> all right so i used to work with this chick and we used to buddy up together when we were flight tennis and i told y'all she was middle east and she used to show me how to smoke my clothes and stuff and how you know so you smell good all day your clothes will smell good all day and i want some but i do not want to order it online because um yeah girl some of that is strong you need to smell it first so 
I'm going to make sure I smell it first before uh, I just purchase something to smoke in the house. Have some Montals. Oh, crazy food. Ooh. Violet, patchouli leaves, diamond rose. Ooh. Orange flowers. Golden sand. Aqua gold. Blue matcha. Oh, oh my God. Okay. These are Montal and Mancera. All right. Sure. Ooh, okay. No. <laughs> Ooh, look at the packaging. Ooh, this is fancy. Ooh. Chanel, madam, is all kind of all kind. Really? And this is from our mob. See, I haven't seen this one. My sister gonna be so mad at me. Let me take a picture and show her what this looks like. He smells this. Let me show him this. This is the Frenchie Intense. And then they have all these. Um, oh, man, I love this thing. This is. This, look how crazy that ball is. <laughs> this, you know what is that? It's a Venetian. The, the Vegas casino name. Uh -huh. Venetian. Is on that name. Oh, yeah. that's what it is. Okay. All right. So before this thing. That's not going to stay. Oh, my God. It's like, what is really going on? It's not going to stay. So anyway, all right. So I'm here at this store called Perfumes Plus International. In the past, I've come to this store and there's a lady that works here that's been like, not so nice. And I haven't had too many present experiences here. Although I know sometimes I would come here and they would have like the latest releases, new things, stuff I was looking for. And every once in a while, I was able to pull up a fragrance like online, and they would be like, Well, that's not our price, but we can come close to it within like five dollars or so. So, I was able to pick up a fragrance here that I wanted from online. I was going to order from online, it was a smaller bottle online. I got ended up getting a 3.6 ounce bottle here, and I'll share it with you all later when I get in. It's maybe five dollars more, whatever. So, I ended up getting it, but um, yeah, so the guy here. Rayhan. <laughs> I'm so glad he was here because baby, I walked in there already thinking like, here we go. They not so pleasant over here, but he was so sweet. I hadn't seen him in like years. So it was good to see him and it was good to, um, you know, be able to purchase a fragrance. And I'm not sure if it's for me or for my son yet. And you'll see why when we get home. Now they did, he did have a fragrance there and it is a dupe of Mademoiselle. However, it was sweeter and it had pheromones in it. And I have it on. And when I say this is so good, it doesn't have a sharp patchouli. It has more of a sweeter, effervescent, like, oh my goodness. This is good. I'm going to hunt this fragrance down. If I cannot find this fragrance by the weekend, I'm just going to come back next weekend and buy it from him. I was like, can I please get the same discount when I come back if I bring my son and he buys some stuff? And he basically told me yes. So, um, come check him out. Just ask for Rayhan. <laughs> please, just don't worry about the lady that's in here. There's several ladies that work here, but there's, there's one main lady. You'll know what I mean. Just ask for Rayhan. And yeah, let's head out to another spot. All right, so... I'm at Southwest Trading. This is where I get my earrings. Or like when I go on a vacation, I just want to pick up some quick jewelry or whatever. And I don't want to wear my jewelry. You know what I'm saying? I want to be more careful you know, when I'm out, out of the country. But this is my fun spot right here. So I'm looking for these bracelets and I'm looking look for these earrings I like to wear. Let's give you a glimpse of the store. You can buy uh, wholesale or in lots or home oh, turn the camera around. So basically you can buy wholesale, you can buy lots. Everything's three, four, or five dollars, some seventeen just depends. Oh, this is cute. I did not come for you, ma'am. Back in the day, we used to buy so much stuff. We used to you know, not pay tax on it. Now they're a little bit stricter. Oh, this is three in a pack. Three for five point five. See how cute this is? I like this kind of stuff, but 
I didn't come for this. <sighs> I came for the earrings. Look at all these. All these beautiful, like, if you like headbands, like, this the spot. All right, so. All right, um, and hats, of course. Hats, hats, and more hats. Oh my God, so much in here. All right, just came for earrings. Look, this would be cool to wear for like, um, like your Halloween costume. You know, you have your gold chain or whatever. <laughs> Remember, like, when you're dressing up like it's salt and pepper or something? Yeah, oh my God, I have to remember that that's here. Yeah, there's so much stuff in this store. When the girls come, I spend like $200 every time, just on stuff. For the Gordy girls, the Divas. Oh, look at this bracelet. Like, are you serious? Right now, oh my god, so y'all know I'm about to lose my stuff. This is so mean. How much is this one? This one's $6.97. Y'all know I'm obsessed with elephants my whole entire life. Oh my god, how much is this one? I don't matter. So they have it in silver, they have this big one. This is so, it's too heavy. They know that's too heavy. Yeah, uh uh. Nope. This one's calling my name. And this one is $5.95. Look. 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 This is so many. I, I don't even know where to go and what to choose from. It's so it's so many, y'all. I hope I wasn't covering up the microphone. Um, I normally just wear my good jewelry, but I never really shop for myself here anymore because the girls take all my money. Um, believe it or not, Christopher likes burnt bracelet too. Men bracelets or whatever. You know those stacks. This is like this is heavy for four dollars. Huh. So there's this price that I want and I need to walk around and see if I can find it. If I find it I'll show it to y'all. But it has balls on it like this. And it's not like Van Cleef and our pills or nothing, but oh, I like this one too. It's just a simple bangle. Oh, okay, hold on. It's like this. It's like this, but it's huge. Like you get a stack like this, but it's bigger. How much are these? Seven ninety five, and you get three bracelets. It's like crisscross a little bit. That they don't have it in silver, y'all. Why it smells so good? <laughs> and so okay, let me go look and see if I can find um this one in like a silver or rose gold tone. Real simple, dainty. I had one like this, and I broke it when I tightened it up. So, but these are cute. So I'm gonna look through all these and see if I can find my hoops, cause I think they moved them. Yeah. So that's my spot. That is my spot. Southwest Trading. That is our our birthday shopping spree. That is my, you know, spot where I'm looking for hats, fun scarves for fall and winter. That is my uh, dupe spot when I want it immediately. Don't want to uh, order from Amazon like dupe earrings and dupe braces or something. And the jewelry is pretty heavy and it lasts quite a bit long time. Like they got some cheapy stuff in there and they got some really good quality stuff. So 
definitely check out check out Southwest Trading if you are in Houston or located near Houston or be in visiting Houston. Just come down Harlem and just shop Harlem from like I would say from Gessner up into Hillcroft. Just shop Harlem, see what you see, what you find, and go from there. Um, Kinsietas, if you're looking for dresses. Don't ask me how I know, friend. She was spoiled when she was young, okay? And if you're looking for, like, um, fajas, like, you know, you got your body done, or you just want to do your body with a faja, they got that up and down the street, okay? If you're looking for sunglasses, they have really good sunglasses, which are the name brand. Like, some of these stores have really good prices. Then they have the dupes. They have really good jewelry. Mm, everything you need to open up a store is on this this street shoes and about shoes but um i'm just looking for slides and sandals and just some little quick um holiday trips you know sandals you don't you don't really care about the brand but um yeah everything i, I bought so much stuff up down the street it's ridiculous in the past I used, not to, I used to not live so far from here too, but um, the halal, like supermarkets, the Indian groceries or whatever. And then if you're looking for like, oh girl, it's like everything trendy. Everything trendy is here. Pink one. And I have all these too. You can smell them instead. I'm home, so let's talk about it. All right, let's just double dabble into the jewelry store real quick before we get into these fragrances. So here's the bracelet that I chose. It's a really cute, like, elephant. Um, yeah, I, I love these cups. I haven't bought these in so long, but oh my God, you see the two elephants? All right, so if you know me, then you know since a child, okay? Yes. Hmm, okay. Anyway, all right, so basically, when I find something I like, I, I normally buy multiples of it. Like these earrings, I told you all I'm obsessed with them, so I end up buying six pairs of these. And just to have them, and that's what they look like. They're just really cute, clasp-like hoops. Very simple, understated. You can kind of, you know, dress them up or dress them down. It could be casual or it could be, so I like this kind of stuff. So I bought like, I think I bought five pairs. So I bought five pairs of these. I purchased, I ended up getting this one, even though I wanted that bracelet, for some reason it looks so, like, not, it just looked, I didn't like it on, but anyway, ended up getting this one, it's just a simple bangle, but I like the size of it, and I wish they had it in silver, and the guy said we had them, but you know, it's it's pretty heavy, like, this is a really good heavy piece, and this one was $6.95, the elephant was $5.95, and the earrings were $5.45 a piece. And then I found these cute little, I don't know, just to play with type of hoops. Just something to kind of, so I end up getting three pairs of these just in case I really like them. And if I don't like them, I, my daughters will wear them. So they're different. So one has something and one doesn't. Oh, I didn't even notice that. One has like, oh, no, 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 it's twisted. Hold on. Okay, yes, it has like this little something at the bottom. I don't know, y'all. But anyway, so I always buy multiples because <laughs> I will lose one. I'm not even joking. So let's talk about the fragrance stores, the perfume stores, right? So the first one I went to, I told you all, was kind of pricey. However, he has everything in there from Tom Ford to Creed to Delina to um, all the perfumes from Marley's to the Jean Paul Gaultier's. A lot of the lower line, like Armov's, Nola Tapas. And all the lower line, like this other brand, and I don't know, like, mm, 
the Venetian and stuff like that. That is the, that's the Armata, right? So he has like several fragrances and he gets the newer stuff. I should say that the just dropped stuff. So if you want to smell it before you order it online, cause it's probably cheaper online, then do that. If you're ordering, if you're purchasing more than one fragrance, you're going to get a discount and it's worth just buying it from him because you don't have to worry about shipping when you're going to get it. It's the convenience of going to the store, picking it up, smell it right there and then buy it. He will give you a discount because you, you're getting multiples. And every Saturday morning, when they first open up, I'm telling you, that's when you go. That's when you get the discount. <laughs> go early and get the discount. All right, so I I like shopping there, but I like sniffing there more than anything, okay? So to the last store I went to, the one I always uh, upload and tell you all, um, that's my store. I like that store because nobody hounds me. Nobody tries to make me buy anything. Even though I like Raheem over there at the perfume place, he is uh, very persuasive and he will make you spend your coins. Girl, he will, you know how you say, mm -hmm, I ain't going, I'm not going to spend no money. Oh, no, no. He, if once he knows your scent profile and what you like, he going to pull every last one of them. He was like, well, I got some unisex fragrances and you need to smell. And I'm thinking to myself, but mm, I only came for this one bottle. No, 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 no. You need to smell them. And I was like, okay, let me smell these things, right? And he's he not lying. He's not lying. All right, so I'll be going online to purchase at least two or three today of what I smell in his store. And I'll shut up with you all when you come. All right, so fast forward to the store I normally shop at. Is it Trendsetters or Trade something? Well, I'll put it at the bottom. You, you'll know when you see it. But anyway, that's the one where I kind of shop around and let me film sometimes. If it's not crowded, I get to sniff like as much as I want to sniff. They normally hand me a huge hand of like the little white strips and I just go for it. And I try not to wear fragrance when I go there because I know I'm spraying myself. And let me tell you, the pink bottle that I sprayed before I left out the store, I don't know if you can still see that. This is like hours, a couple hours later. See that? I have gone to all the use. The ladies room, wash my hands. My hands are clean and I can still smell this fragrance. Then this one is the white one. That is the Armand bottle, that funny looking bling bottle. I'll put it here. That he says smells like Legere, the Carolina Herrera one. I don't know about that, but it's been on this long and it still smells good. <laughs> and I'm sure it's cheaper online. I'm gonna get that one too. The bottle was hideous with the stoles and with the little metal pieces. Oh, that was horrible, but I'm gonna get it anyway, just because. And if it's not for me, it'll be for the girls. But anyway, so the place I really enjoy shopping at, where they don't bother you, you can sniff and whatever. That's where I go when y'all say, have you smelled this or have you smelled that or you should try this because I know they're going to have it. So they have all of the top of dupes of the Tom Ford fragrances. They have all the Tom Ford fragrances. So you can actually smell the Tom Ford fragrances there and then smell the dupe at the same time in store. They have all the, the not all, but most of the Parker and Marty dupes like the Pegasus. That other one starts with the G, whatever. There, plus the original. So you can compare the two. They have like uh, Chanel Mademoiselle plus the dupe. The dupe of Giorgio Armani My Way plus Giorgio Armani. You see what I'm saying? Same thing, YSL Man plus the dupe. So you're able to sniff and see like, okay, well, how close is it? Do you really want the dupe or just pay for the fragrance, okay? And I can tell you this, their prices in their stores are usually less expensive than buying it in store. So you get a better deal. They might have had the latest fragrance come from Tom Ford, like those last two cherry ones, but they have, okay, go, just go. The more you buy, the more you save, I'm just telling you. All right, so let me show you what I picked up. I've been saying I'm gonna get this fragrance, so I went ahead and purchased it just to complete. It's not even complete. I think I'm still missing like, well, I don't wanna say that. There's still like the new black bottle that is the masculine bottle. I still kind of want to smell that. It's just not, I haven't seen it in a smaller ounce. I don't want to spend that much money on that big bottle. No, I'm just going to spray it around my house. So this is Club de Nuit and this is Untold. And this is supposed to be a, like a dupe of the Baccarat, but it has its own take on it. So it's a little bit different in stores. I could tell it was different. It comes to the little cards from our mob yeah 
Let me open this up. So this is what the bottle looks like, a little holographic. So for the 3.6 ounce bottle, he say it's $80, <laughs> whatever. It was fifty something dollars. They were no eighty dollars. Y'all know I'm not gonna pay no eighty dollars for no bottle. But online, y'all, these were expensive, and the two ounce bottles were like forty something, fifty bucks. So, hey y'all, I looked on Fragrance by CA this morning, and for the hundred and five ml bottle, it was forty seven, something like that, for a tester. So go check it out. Yeah, I don't know, but anyway, it's the packaging. Our mark is just regular. They don't really, yeah. But I have so much fragrance on. Let me just spray out the nozzle first for a little bit. It has this thing to it that I get when I smell Instant Crush. You know how Mancera has this heady woodiness to it? Like it's the Mancera thing where it's kind of like thick and very musky, like this heavy cloud. I feel like that added to BR540 is what this is. So I, I you know, I like it. So that's why I got it. And I'm going to decant some of this and give some to my son. But just so you can see kind of like what the bottle looks like. It's a little, yeah. So at the top is a little screechy. It is a grown woman's cotton candy. But it's, it's a unisex fragrance. And I know my son has all the oils. And he was like, well, I don't really need it. And I was like, I'm going to give you something anyway. Yeah, I don't know if I like it. Yeah, this is different than that Baruch bottle for sure. The Baruch bottle is much sweeter to me, kind of, sort of. I don't know what it's going to smell like in four or five months, so I won't say that because I like to let these sit for a little while. But I don't even know if the notes are on here on Fragrance Cut, and if it is, I'll look it up for a while. I, I mean, I'll look it up for a second to see if the notes are on here, but I just know that it's basically a dupe, and it, it's pretty good. It's sweet and yeah i'm gonna let this sit for a little bit because it's not as strong as the sample i tried and he even said let it sit for a little while so it has saffron jasmine at the top amber wood amber grease fur resin and sear and yeah it's a little bit different i don't want to spray anymore on me i have so much fragrance on me i really need to shower and start over but yeah, this is a really good one. I like it. I think it's affordable at the store. If I can find it at a really good price online, I'll try to find it and link it down below. Because, you know, these go off and on, on sale, off sale. I know when they first came out during like the winter time, or whatever, last year, they were like 50 bucks, 55, 16, everybody was getting them. And then we couldn't find them. They were sold out. And finally, they kind of came back in slowly at 70 zool. So <laughs> I think not. But yeah, so at... I wouldn't pay no more than like 60 bucks, but yeah. So it's sweet. I was hoping to uh, be able to layer it with Imperial. So that's what I'm hoping for those two, to layer these and see how they smell together. Because, yeah. But the three point, is this 3.62? Let me see if this is, I don't even know. I can't see. I know I can't see. Yeah, so they, they're probably both three point um, something, four to six ounce bottles. Which is really good for the price when you think about it. Yeah, so Mancera's bottles are normally like four ounces. So to give you like an idea of whatever. Yeah, I don't know. I got so much stuff on me. So trendsetters. So I went online to compare the price online before I checked out. Because I was like, uh, no, nah, I'm going to show them the price online. And let them know I can get this much cheaper. But guess what, girl? It's gone up in price. It's 39 jewels everywhere. 35 or 37, 37.99 on Amazon, something like that. So for an extra dollar, 39 dollars and some change. I just went ahead and picked it up in store. So this is um un uh 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 ensemble. Ensemble. How does she pronounce the girl? Anyway, ensemble gold. And this is what it looks like. Everybody's been talking about it. I finally got it. Yeah. And it smells good. It smells good. I smelled it in the store. It smells good. There was one other one I was really tempted to buy instead of buying this one. But this one actually smells really good. And let me tell you. Um, I took pictures of a few other fragrances I was interested in actually purchasing. And yeah, Nebris has become a hit. He was like, oh yeah, everybody want Nebris. And it's 65. Mm -mm. I'm online. It was 60 some dollars. And I was like, oh yeah, I was tripping. When Nebras go back to $30, y'all go get that. The little packaging looks like that it comes in. And then here is the bottle. Okay. 
So I have seen a couple of videos go out where people are saying it smells like Oriana or like similar. Not really a dupe, but it has certain notes in it that are very reminiscent or you get wafts of it along with like another fragrance. So I don't know. I'm just going to tell you how I feel about this as just smelling in the store. I did like it. I thought it was really good. It's kind of fruity. It says it has mandarin orange, pear, sweet notes, jasmine, rose, vanilla musk, and raspberry. It's like this fluffy, sweet, uh, I'm going to have to spray this out. I can't spray nothing else on me. It's sweet. It's sweet. When it first opens up, yeah, it's like, almost like bubblegum and some kind of candy. Yeah, maybe like... Something sweet and fluffy. Maybe like, mm. I have no, I have no space on me. Okay, so it comes off a little strong and sweet and sharp in the beginning, but it's like sweet, like bubblegum sweet, like cotton candy sweet, like fluffy, sticky, jasmine, like flanked with candy and sugar. Yeah, it's, it's really good. I kind of like it. I just need to just bathe and just wear it by itself and then come back and really talk about it. I do like it. And it doesn't make me say, oh my God. You know, but I think it's because I smelled like over 40 fragrances today, I want to say. Maybe about 40. And I'm just like, oh, I don't think I smell anything else. So right now it's strong to me. It smelled good. It reminds me of something as if it had orange blossom, jasmine, sweet bubblegum tuberose, and some like fruity sticky something, like almost cotton candy. Girl, oh, but yeah, it's really good, but I just, you know, I need to wear it. I need to wear it. My mouth tastes like perfume. I even was tempted to stop and get like a black coffee just to get the flavor out my tongue and my mouth. And normally I can smell like naked skin and try to make it go away. But I don't have naked skin right now. Every piece of my body is covered with something. So I'm about to go wash all this off. But um, yeah, so I plan on going back to that one shop, the little hole in the wall with the husband and wife with the fragrances that were the inspired fragrances of Memo. Stay tuned for a mini haul. We'll be buying like one or two fragrances. This is not your 20 fragrance haul channel, okay? Just so you know. <laughs> don't hold your breath. But I will be getting, there's some fragrances I smell today, and I literally saved them all in both of these phones. I was like, okay, this case, I deleted, but in this phone too, because y'all, they were good. So it was good to see that some of the fragrances I was interested in too were not like 10 to 12, $20 more than like online, like they used to be. I think they know now, like, okay, we're competing with. And I would go in there and say, well, Triple Traders and Amazon have. And he was like, well, you know, you're not going to get it for four days. And I can wait for $10. I can wait. Like, I'm just, I'm here smelling it now. I know what it smells like. And then I can come back because I know I can wait. Was there anything else I want to share with y'all before I close out this video? I don't think so. And if it is, we'll talk about it. Anyway, so I'll be back to get that one bottle, like I said, for Memo. And there's a few others that were in store that I have not seen online. Actually, this whole line right here, I'll put it here. I have not seen this line like anywhere, so I'm going to hunt for it to see what is it. Is it duping something? Is it its own fragrance? What's going on with it? I like the bottle. It's a little gold piece in the front. You can actually spin it. The bottles are really heavy, very like, you know, just ornate. They was just heavy and yeah, I don't know. $69, okay? But if you buy like something else, they would knock off a few dollars. But I was like, oh, this is nice. This is nice. And I asked him when your price was going up. And he was like, well, some stuff fluctuate or whatever. And I was like, yeah, I remember when all Middle Eastern fragrances was like $19 in here. You can get $19, $29, $39, $49. And that was about it. It was no $69, $100 like fragrances there. There was no starting off at $29. Like we would get $14 and $10. I remember last summer hauling $12 fragrances. So... <laughs> Yeah, it, the prices are going up. And he was like, yeah, everybody wants to come in here and get Middle East and they're not really getting a lot of designer fragrances right now. 
And I was like, I can see why. And he was like, so it's cheaper to get those than the other fragrances. But, and I didn't even ask him what was new in designer sense because I just didn't go in there for that. But if you want either or designer, some niche fragrances, some um, Middle Eastern fragrances, definitely check out Trendsetter. So I'll put everybody's uh, name and address down below. And I'll see you all in the next video. Thanks for hanging out with me today. If you have any questions about any of the stores and my experience or whatever, I'll come back and talk about this one. And we'll come back and do like a little about this one on the full wear if you want me to. I'll see you on the next video. Once again, if you like this video, please give me a like. It pushes it out, lets the algorithm know that you like me. And then maybe others will come over and see me. And if you like vlogs and you like hanging out with me throughout the day in and out of stores, let me know. I could take you with me like I do on the other channel. And make sure you subscribe and make sure you click the bell so we notify each and every time I do an upload. And yes. It's time to go wash all of this off. Peace and blessings.